Hey, Minecraft Mentor here, and today we're going over three different machines that have to do with dyes. And first, we're going to start with the pigment extractor. This one extracts colors or pigment from any object that has it. So you could do uh, from flowers. We can have it extract uh, orange dye from candles. One of the better ones is orange wool. You get a lot more uh, liquid dye here for that one. Let's throw in uh, our orange chemical tank. This is how I figured out how we get the dye out. For some reason, it doesn't send it automatically uh, to the machine next to it for the pigment mixer, but it will do that for the painting machine. So if we have a painting machine here, it'll automatically send it in there if you have your settings right over here and you don't have a tank here. So anyways, uh, this can be done with a wide variety of items, banners, beds, you know, wool carpet, the dye itself actually. So black dye you could turn into uh, black pigment. Concrete, terracotta, kind of get the idea for that one. Uh, it just extracts it. You can pull the items from here, and or liquid, I guess, liquid pigment from here, and place it into the painting machine if you like. As you can see, this one is automatically going over. Let's pull that out of there. On its own for the painting machine. Now, this one's pretty straightforward. The painting machine is if you want to change the color of an item. So let's say you have some orange pigment. Let's grab some black wool here. So we can actually uh, dye the black wool orange without having to do anything. You can do this with stained glass. Uh, you can see here we've got yellow concrete powder. So not just concrete, you can do it with concrete powder. You can change banners if you made a mistake. Glass, stain, oh, well, I already said stained glass. Uh, you can make this dye base and that will give you your black dye back if you uh, want it out of the pigment form. So. Almost exactly the same thing, it's just the opposite of uh, this thing right here with the painting machine. Now the dye mixer, uh, this mixes your dyes, so if you want different colors, you're going to place in one of these tanks. I'm going to do uh, red and blue, which makes purple, and it's going to send it into the middle here. You can make your purple dye like that and then put it into your painting machine. So if you want to pull it out of here, same thing, you just need a tank or not. Oh, that's right. This one's got orange pigment. It's not going to allow me to put put uh, in there. He almost made me a liar over there for a second, but I figured it out. There we go. It's going to automatically put our purple pigment into our tank, and then you take this tank out, bring it on over here, and let's say uh, we place it in there. If there was orange dye not in here, it would uh, let us do that. But that's it for this one. If you found it helpful, like, comment, subscribe.